second speech, and I really enjoyed listening to you and felt that you've come a long way since your first speech, which I also enjoyed. I really like your opening. I thought it was really cool how you were able to bring up coming back to the airplane. I said I slept on the way there, but on the way back, I read this book, and I want to tell you about that. I thought that was very clever. You had very good pace. A little trouble in the beginning hearing you, but you picked up your voice a little bit. So just keep that in mind. But after that, I was able to do that. So I really enjoyed your pace. It was clear, and it was easy to understand. One note on the body language. You start to play the hands a little bit sometimes. Be careful with that, because sometimes that could be distracting. You didn't do it all the time, but then you went back to it like this again. You had a nice center stage so everybody can see you. And you also had a very good job looking around so everybody had great eye contact. And that's a great thing to have because you get people involved. I really liked, though, how you kept asking the question, do you guys know who this is? And then he gave some more facts and more facts. And he said again, do you know who this is? That was cool because it really kept us interested. It really kept us really engaged in what you were trying to talk about. And then we're like, we can't wait to hear who it is. And then he said the great fact of, oh, no, by the way, he's blind. So now we're really interested. That was very clever to lead up to where you were going to of who this gentleman was. One note on your voice. When you do a quote and you started saying, we got to keep, and I'm paraphrasing now, but something to the effect where you said, we need to keep, keep an eye on this blind guy. I think you, you did as a quote. Maybe change your voice a little bit so it differentiates what you're trying to do. And that would really bring but here's what I really like the best. Because I was thinking to myself, is she going to tell us how this affected her? Why did she pick this? Why did she want to share this story with us? And when you said, my fellow Toastmasters, everybody was just like, OK, here we go. And so I thought it was even better than saying what he did to me. You said, Phil, so this is what this was brought home to me. This is why I really like this guy. Very clever, very good, and a very strong conclusion. I enjoyed it very much. And